Hello everyone, my name is Royce Electron. Welcome to the game called The Ma There is a Man in the Attic. That's such a long title, but the game launcher just says The Man in the Attic. I don't know which one is the real one, but the title in itch.io, because th that's where I got this game from, is There's a Man in the Attic. But anyways, let's go and start this game. Um, let's go and check the controls first. There's no controls? Okay. When I was a kid, I often had the same nightmare. I was about this... It was about this man just standing in my room looking at me. I was convinced that he came from the attic. I shared a bedroom with my brother at that time. And, and, when I wa man, and when I had this dream, I often spoke out loud during my sleep. According to my brother, I said things like, Somebody's here, there's a man here, he's here. He freaked my brother out in the middle of the night just a couple of times. I'm an adult now, and that horrible nightmare is just distant memory now. Can't read. Okay. So he probably saw his dad. Uh, he's just, you know, sleeping. I don't know. Maybe there's really a man in the attic. Anyways. What do I hear? Is that, is that water running? Phone. Sounded like it came from here. Is it raining outside or is someone taking a shower? You can hear water dropping like a shower. Dropping? <laughs> Like, it's water running. Dropping is a lot better sounding than running. Like, why would water run? Is it scared of something? Maybe the man in the attic. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Let's keep our eyes on there because someone might appear. Also, why do I walk like this? Why am I this low? It's like walking one meter per second. What am I? Turtle man? Is my, are my legs intertwined? I don't know what's happening right now, but I don't need to use the bathroom now because there's someone in there. The man in the bathroom. Taking a shower. It's gone now. Maybe he's... Maybe they're using soap now. They just rinsed before. I don't know. I feel like I heard some freaking whispering. Okay. The water's back on now. I don't know if that's really a shower or it's raining outside, but phone. Check phone. Hey brother, I just wanted to let you know that we've arrived at we've arrived at home safely. Thank you for the invitation. We had a great time and it was nice to catch up. I also feel like I have to apologize for Lily's behavior. But you know how kids are not and their imagination. She was probably very tired tired as well. See you later. Take care. What? What is he talking about? It's getting late, but I should clean up first. Uh, it's kind of not dirty. Clean up dining table? Okay. Clean table. Today my brother came to visit, and he thought he brought his family along, his wife and their seven-year-old daughter. Her name is Lily, and technically she's my niece. Why, what do you mean technically? She is! She is your niece! I can't freaking speak. <laughs> it's been a while since I last seen them. So we spent about half an hour catching up with each other, just talking. After a while I noticed that Lily was really uninterested. I don't blame her. After all, adults talking about everyday stuff is probably most boring. It's probably the most boring thing for a child. I'm a pretty good uncle, so I offered to let her watch TV in the upstairs room. And then she saw the man in the attic, showed her all the cartoon channels and let her there to watch some TV away from the boring adults she was grateful. Yes, boring adults we are. I mean, you are, and your brother, and her wife. Do you have a wife? Probably not, because you have one small bedroom that your house is... Well, you have multiple cha chairs, so I assume you have some someone else's... Here living with you, but who's that noise? Do you want some food? I've got some plate here, but I don't know where the food is. I don't have any more left. You can just lick this off. No? Okay. Do dishes. Okay. The night went on. Seemed like everyone had a good time. Dinner was ready, so I was about to go upstairs to get Lily to eat with us. And that's when all of a sudden Lily ran downstairs screaming. She looked absolutely terrified. It took her a couple of minutes before she could speak. But then she finally said this. There was a man upstairs staring at me from the doorway. Hmm. The man in the doorway. Yes. <laughs> Confused, 
Perhaps it was a bit... Perhaps a bit frightened, we all went upstairs, searched everything, checked the attic as well, only to find nothing. Eventually, my brother dismissed Lily's story, claimed she was probably just getting tired, and soon after they left for the night. I'm once again completely alone in the house, and Lily's story sounds way too familiar. Yep. Alone in a house? I don't think I would like that. Well, most of the time I'm alone, just, you know. Yeah, it is rain. It is raining outside. Oh. Raining and horror activities in the house? That, that doesn't go well for the person getting scared, but it's a great combination if you want. Time to get some sleep. If you want to scare someone, do it in the rain. Because, you know, sounds are muffled. That's just one tip for me. If you want to scare someone, do it in the rain. Go to bed. Can you walk any faster? <laughs> Why is he walking like this? I'm, I'm walking like a freaking snail. If I if I have to run from the man in the attic, I don't know what I would do. I'd be running like this while the man is, is running like, I don't know, regular person? How fast does a regular person run? I don't know. Maybe like 3 meters per second, but this guy... Oh, three meters per second. Yeah, that's that sounds good enough for me. <laughs> well, maybe not everybody, but sounds like something I can do. Just you know, jiggle peek over here. No, no. Okay. No one's okay. My bedroom. Okay. According to Lily's story, this is where the man was standing, looking straight at her. Ooh, 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 something's making noise in my room. I don't know what it is, but I'm scared. According to Lily's story, it is where the man was standing, looking straight at her from this doorway before returning to the attic, just like in my dreams. Maybe it's your dad. Maybe she's just living in your attic, and you didn't, you haven't seen him since. Sounds like a very good hypothesis, but I don't know. Man in the attic? Sounds like a dad. Ooh hoo hoo! Oh ho ho! He's doing some moving around things. That's, that's, yeah, that's a thing. Moving around things. He's doing that. Sounds like a freaking table. These noises, they are coming from the attic. Sound like downstairs rather than the attic. At least with my headphones. Maybe I'm flipped vertically. Maybe I should go and record like that. <laughs> I don't know. Could I go into the bathroom now? Just so I have a hiding place? I don't need to use the bathroom now. Will I ever need to use the bathroom? Maybe when I shit my pants after the, this man in the attic scares me. I don't know, I don't have diapers right now. I don't like this. Look at that, pitch black, pitch, pitch darkness. Uh, that is a sign that someone is just gonna go jump at you. Okay, there's a bit of light. Where is that light? I don't like this. I don't like this. You know what? I don't care. Even if there's noises in this room that I'm in right now. Here, me. Not this game. Okay, what is that? What is that getting covered by the cloud? Who is that? Is that a man? Is that the man? Are you the man? I'm the man. We're both the man. Spider-Man? No? Attic man? I don't know. Maybe the, someone in this closet? Search the attic. It's dark in here. Do I not have any more light? Ooh. Oh, I, oh, I don't like that freaking face. That face. That is the face of horror. Yes. Oh my freaking god! I don't know where I'm even looking at anymore. Hello. I'm just staring at this picture. You know what's happening? Can I? This is stupid, there's nothing up here. Where there's a lot of things up here, so you're wrong. But something 
Unnatural? There is... Yes, there is. <laughs> I, I was gonna say... There's nothing, but there is. Go back to bed. Ah, it's something here. Just starts to chase me. I don't think I can ever run. I'm walking like a snail. Like a turtle. Even if a rabbit... I don't know. A turtle comes after me. I don't think I can run away from that. No, I'm just looking behind me to see if there's a, a creature that would spawn. As I walk away, trying to scare me, like you know how games are. Things just spawn behind you to scare you. I mean, that's pretty stupid if you do that and you, you don't lock their like control over the camera. But, okay, it's got an quiet. That is not a good sign for a horror game. Why am I singing? Not in a Disney movie. What is happening here? Is, is the man in the attic in my room? Is the man in the room now? Nope. Okay. Can I check the bathroom maybe? Because I heard some squeaking sounds. Might be the floor or the door. Or maybe. But open it. Open it. Anyways. Hello? Man in the attic. I have a gun. Is he just... Well, I don't, but... That's a lie. It's, it's just scary. Hello? Have a gun. If you want to come out, now's the time. No? Okay. Oh no, it's raining. There's thunder. Oh ho ho, the game listened to me. No, I mean the real world listened to me. It said when you're doing horror stuff, do it in the rain and now it starts raining when I'm playing a horror game. I don't like this. Every time I play a horror game, something unnatural happens. Unusual, yes, it's natural, but it's unusual. Also the other time, I had my lights flickering on a metal of a horror game. Like I was in the horror game. I don't know why that happens to me. Maybe the, the games in edge that IO are cursed. Maybe they... When you play them, they apply in real life. But I heard some squeaking. Is it... In the closet? The man in the closet? You can change your title if that's... That's the case here. No, can't interact with it. Go to bed. Oh no, someone's... Someone's gonna pull me off my bed and go downstairs, you know, like freaking... Sometimes a strange noise at night keeps you awake. Then you anxiously search for the cause, but you won't find anything. And you question it once more. Oh no, you're gonna go out again? What time is it? It's probably like, I don't know, 2 in the morning? in the morning yeah that is the time okay the showers back on still raining probably yep <laughs> but it means shower and rain maybe it's both at the same time happening he doesn't want to check his bathroom because you know someone's taking a shower for the whole night okay can you move on now I don't know what's happening in this game Well, oh no, oh no, I don't like this. Is the man in the attic real? Hello? Why can't I move? Am I not moving? Well, I am moving, just... Ten times slower than before, but what's happening? Not even doing anything. It's just moving on its own. Okay. Oh no, this is where the the, the jump scares happen. Man in the attic, can you just show us the light? No. Oh. That plant shadow scares me. 
Looks like freaking something from a horror movie, like you know. And like most horror movies, with you know, like dark vines scrolling around along the walls, and then someone just moves. Where is it? Is there no man in the attic? Still ready for the jump scares. If you're gonna give out one. Ooh! Ooh! The eyes! There were eyes in the stairs! Ooh -hoo -hoo. That, that gave me goosebumps. I don't know if my. Yep, they're standing a little bit. My hair. <laughs> my hair. Fear is subjective, but it's not uncommon to be afraid of the man in the attic or the man in the basement. Perhaps the man under your bed. Yeah, sounds like a dad, really. <laughs> man in the attic, the basement, under your bed. Well, under your bed doesn't sound like one. Maybe if it's broken. Or maybe if you live in a... You, you, you have a bunk bed and your dad sleeps under you. It's... All not... All applicable to be a dad. But... That was not really that much scary. You know the scariest thing about that game is? The how slow I'm moving. Someone just started. Thank, thank you for playing my specific fear, the man in the attic. Someone just came ca running up to me, starts chasing me. I don't think I would be able to run. That's like every dream ever. You, you run like a freaking snail, but you're as big as a man. I don't know why that's the thing in our th in our brains. Why do we always like run slow in our dreams, but you know. Uh, <laughs> but uh, like you know other people just run fast and we run slow and Also, I found a hack with that when I <laughs> when I'm dreaming I feel like whenever I'm dreaming and I run slow I start jumping and jumping is actually faster than running. I don't know why but I jump much higher in my dreams <laughs> Anyways Is that the game is that the man in the attic? There's not really that much like story in there Well, I guess every game most games in each that I was just, you know, horror games that doesn't have much story. It's just, you know, like a specific event in one day and or maybe one week. I don't know how long most of them are, but it's like just maybe. Uh, it's like from what I've observed, it's like more more into like just one night or just a few hours th that they don't have any story. Like it's just one event. And, you know, I feel like people are just practicing making games and making, like, you know, atmosphere for, like, a horror scenario and, like, more... And, like, their future games with more stories and the thunder interrupting me when I'm talking. Anyways, yeah, that was a interesting game. Uh, would be nice if there was, like, more of it or maybe, like, there's more jump scares or it was longer a little bit. But I was just... Waiting for it, for the jump scares, but it's not, it didn't happen. I don't know why, but scariest thing in that game was me running slow and the picture frame in the attic. That's all. That's all that I've been creeped about. Well, maybe the last thing is you know the eyes in the stairs. Like it's just so low. It's, it didn't even match like the height. If there was really a man with glowing eyes and sta standing in the stairs, it didn't even match the height. It's like he's like sitting on the stairs or his head is like you know cut off and it's just you know on there on the stairs <laughs> i don't know but anyways that was the man there's a man in the attic if you enjoyed it uh you can go check it out on h.io it's free or you can pay for it if you want to support, support the creator but anyways thank you guys so much for watching this episode if you like the video smash the thumbs up button starts again leave a comment down below on what, on what you want to see next and i'll see you in the next video electrify electrify with you